Hi, this is Shannon from Canada Week, and I'm here with another week review. This time we are looking at Fresh by Ellen Villa. So this is um, a monofilament part wig. There is no lace front. So you get the monofilament part feature on the left hand side, and then you're just gonna get um, the basic cap. You get a bit of a silicone um, rim here to help keep it on your head, but there is no lace front. So you're definitely gonna wanna keep the bangs down on this particular wig. Um, you could, however, part the bangs a little more center if you wanted to. It wouldn't be right center because your monofilament side part is like right here, but you could take it down and have a little bit. I, I feel like it looks a bit better with a deeper part, but um, that would be, of course, your choice. Um, so the measurements on this wig are 6.5 inches at the top, 3.5 inches at the bang, 6.5 inches on the side and the back, and then has a nape of 1.25 inches. So it's just a very cute, um, a little bit shorter than a bob, I would say, and there is not a lot of hermitese in this one. So you're not gonna get a ton of height and volume, but it is, it's shaped very nicely to your head. So I think it's, it's very flattering on. Um, there's not a ton of hair either, which is classic of Ellen Villa, their lower density wigs. So you're, you're just getting that realistic looking hair that's shaped to your head. Um, I can kind of show you, if you really did want to get more volume, you could. Um, you definitely have to use some wig hairspray, I think, to keep this up here, or maybe even back home it a little bit, but you can see that you can get it up a little bit higher if that's what you want, or if you're someone who likes it really smooth and flat, then you can definitely, you can tame it down. So I think it, it kind of, if you find that happy medium, I think that's where it's gonna look the best, so. And as you can see, you can tuck it behind the ear okay, um, and that's really cute. I think the, the main thing you're gonna run into is that you don't have that lace front. So right there, you can kind of see the rim. Um, if you're someone who's really self-conscious, you might find that bothers you, but I mean, from far away, like I don't think, I don't think anyone's really gonna notice that. I think it looks just fine, so. It's totally your call on what you what you feel most comfortable with. So let me just show you this one from all sides. So let me just talk about the color on this one quickly. Um, this one is dark auburn mix. So that is 33-132. So um, the 30, 33 and the 130 will be the very, very red shades in this one. And then the, the two would be um, almost a black. So it doesn't look really dark. So if, you, if you're someone who's like, oh, I can never wear black, um, I wouldn't worry. It's, it's not really pulling black at all. So um, it's definitely pulling more of a dark auburn. So I think that if you are used to a darker auburn, um, you like red, you're not afraid to go darker red, then I think that this would be a gorgeous color for you. And I think it's very flattering. Um, it really just draws out your skin tone, I think, and it's, it's really nice. Um, these front pieces do hug the face really nicely as well. You can tell they are, they sit right here. So they really emphasize the jawline and that's gonna be really flattering also. Um, overall, it's very lightweight, very comfortable to wear. Um, the monofilament part is really done nicely. Um, and then I'll just, I'll show you that basic cap there. So as I mentioned, you're not gonna wanna pull those off the face, but uh, they stay really nicely to the side. Like I don't have any problems if I look down, they're staying. So I think it's, it would be a very comfortable, a very comfortable style to wear. And I think that this one would last you quite a while cause it's up so high, it's not gonna be rubbing on any sweaters or scarves or anything like that. So um, you'll get a lot of use out of this one. So overall, I really like this one. Um, it's Fresh by Ellen Villa. I hope this was helpful. If you want to see more of these wig reviews, please subscribe to our channel because we're going to be doing more on a regular basis. Hope you have a good day.